What's up guys? My name is Travis and I'm going to be starting a YouTube channel. The channel is going to be called Night Chasers. What is Night Chasers you ask? It is a merchandise store that I am starting. Um, hopefully by the end of March it will be open. Stickers, hats, hoodies, shirts, keychains, maybe some shift knobs. This is my roommate Jeff. How's it going? He, uh, he does car stuff with me. Um, the whole point of this channel is going to be recording all the car stuff I do all day every day because my occupation right now is I buy cars, fix them up and I sell them and in between doing that I work on my cars as well um, on this channel you'll be seeing drag racing, drifting autocrosses, rally crosses, hopefully some track days toge, Mexico, car shows, car meets did I miss anything? drifting? no I said that off-roading, I'm trying to get an off-roading Oh. Uh, circle track racing, some Max D at this local racetrack. Um, a lot of car shows and car meets, probably cruising and stuff. You do a little bit about everything. Yeah, try to do everything. So it'll be kind of fun. Now I have a ton of cars here, and I think I should make a separate video for each car. Um, we'll just start with. This is what we have. Yeah, in this video, I'll show you what we're working with. Right here is his. Jeffries probe. It's KLZE swapped, and the coilovers on it are worth more than the car. Um, <laughs> Why is popping that hood? This is my '86 Jetta, called the Whore. Um, it's been passed around a lot, like a whore. Lots of history, lots of motors. Um, there's actually videos from way back on this channel of it racing with the built eight valve. Right now it's got just a 16 valve sitting in it. I don't know when that's going to be done. I don't know what I'll do motor-wise this year, but... This is this KLZ swapped probe. Um, full bolt-ons. Cam gears. I don't know if it's got cams in it. We don't know that, do we? When I looked it up, I believe it had stock KLDE cams. Did it? But, I mean, basic bolt-ons. Sweet car. Track, track car. Yep. This is a 97 Prism. Um, I used to own this car and I got it off my buddy when he well messed up his fender and blew the motor. It's a big old hole in the block. Oop. Let's see, you can see it right down there. There it is. So that's getting a 7 AFE and a close ratio trans and a fender. Um, then that'll be up for sale. This is also one of my buddy's cars. 99 Civic, piece of crap. It's really not. Um, this has a D16Y7 with a D16Z6 head, so it's a mini me swap. The head is built, Delta 272 cam, um, full port, all that shit. It needs the uh, Y8 intake on it, the P28, and a lot of cleaning. This is my 92 duster my daily driver in the summer um, this thing is 6g72 mitsubishi motor v6 five speed um i need to need to finish the the engine bay um yeah bolt-ons got it intake a bunch of stupid stuff y'all don't care about um runs good Sucks that she's so low because it's kind of hard to drive it with the roads we have because she just bangs trains off the ground, so she sits a lot. This is my OBS. The work truck. The work truck and the tow truck and all that. Junkyarding truck. Junkyarding truck. She yeah, is reliable here. <laughs> she's amazing. Uh, it's got sweet bass boat paint on it, but you can't tell because she's so fucking dirty. Um, 96, Vortec 350s, enough power for me. This, <laughs> this, this car, you'll be seeing this car soon, is a Toyota Tercel, 1996. Uh, I got it off my buddy. I traded him this 3G Eclipse I had and some cash for it because he needed a car because he got he got T-boned so that's why there's no door but 
I like this little car for some reason. There's a one of our stickers. And then, oh yeah, the Civic. The Civic's got a different style on it than the duster in the truck. Just to show y'all. There it is. So, this is my Z31. This thing also has a ton of history. Um, we called it the beater, because it is a freaking beater. Uh, but, it was, uh, it was NA. VG30, and then I had gotten a turbo parts car for it, and I had NA2T'd it, and a E85, bigger injectors, all that. It was a quick car. Um, I beat a lot of impressive stuff with it. Now she sits here. Waiting for her motor to be built. Racing on hopes and dreams. But, I got a VG33 for it, and uh, a compound turbo setup. I don't know how it's going to work, but we'll see. There's a bunch of shit. That's the Tercel door. It needs to go away. This is Jeff's 91? 92. 92 Jetta. 188 valve. 188 valve. Um, he made a big mistake. He traded a low mile, perfectly running daily driver Cavalier for it. But, you know, the Cavalier is boring. You know, and this thing, well, Mark II Jettas are sweet. It's a 188 valve. I think I already said that, I don't know. Coil over his wheels, standard stuff. He actually just, we just stripped down. Um, uh, 89. 89 Jetta. 89 Mark II Jetta. Um, Got some the cool. motor's in the horror and all the interior out of it, really nice for car interior is gonna be going in this. This um, one should be getting some new floors soon. Yeah, it needs the floor patch. And then hopefully a built engine, because. Yeah, that engine sucks. I believe this is low compression. You'll be seeing this race to Tercel soon. This is my, one of my favorite cars. Um, 92 Geostorm GSI. And, oh, you didn't want that in your car, dude? <laughs> no. You don't like it? it smells like Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid smells good. When you drink it. <laughs> um, need some work. Runs and drives. Need some small fine tuning. I need to clean up stuff like that. Very clean car, which is what I like. Surprisingly, I think the cleanest Geostorm in Michigan that I know of. Probably. Because you never see these. This is basically an Isuzu in the place. Um, there's so many backs you can see. This is my 95 Chevy Beretta. And she looks beat because she is, but this is the track car. Um, full suspension, sway bars, Quaif LSD, 225 speed, so not a lot of power, but enough dumb eBay header. Fully stripped. Yeah, you can't see it. That is my son. And that is the 08 Commander. My wife's daily. In the garage, we've got Jeff's something of a Saturn. Uh, he's doing a NA drag car build on it right now. And it is stripped. And <laughs> It, it doesn't run. No, it doesn't uh, run. Needs a lot of work. Needs a lot of work. This is also my car. It's also being used as a table. Being used as a table. Um, this is getting an IT bead Saturn engine in it. So, we haven't touched these cars in a while because we've been so busy. This is a buddy's car. He's actually giving us this car. Um, we got to take this LS out and put it in a different car for him with that motor over there and then we get to keep that car and he's given us a VG30 DE with it so we're just going to get it running with a DE put a giant Night Chasers livery on it and send it at the drift track along with my Z31 two Z's drifting should be a lot of fun I, I, can't, I thought we had more cars 
Well, I just got rid of the E-clips. Oh, damn it. I just got rid of the E-clips, and I also just sold a Saturn wagon that was super sick. So, well, that's a wrap-up for this video. Um, Stay tuned for more. What was that? Stay tuned for more. There you go.